Hi, I'm Rick Foy. Once again, we're back here at the Hot Rod Garage to talk about one of my personal projects, the 57 Chevy Nostalgia Gasser. Uh, my main goal with this car has been to make it legal to run a Nostalgia Gasser, which means everything in the car has to be pre-1967, inside, outside. Uh, so this is, this is a build of parts I've been taking off of cars for the last 40 some odd years and uh, brought them back because they are outdated. They made the car legal, legal for this class. Part of this making the car legal is uh, the paint. So I went with an authentic paint color. And this week here we had uh, a couple of local legends in the shop. We had uh, Zeke Lemansky and Johnny Catania come down and do all the writing and, and naming of the car, all that kind of stuff in authentic hand done pinstriping, no decals. Okay, uh, so they came down and did all the writing and lettering on the car, all done by hand in a brush. Old school, authentic to the 60s drag race uh, image and, and uh, done just the way it was done back then. Uh, with all the same colors and, and uh, I wanted the, the gold leaf, the machine turned gold leaf letters, that kind of stuff so that it pops off the side of the car. In a decal, it doesn't pop like this. And in a, a, a wrap, it doesn't pop like this. The only way to get this look is to get the real deal. And Johnny Catania and, and Zeke Lemansky came through and they took care of business. So let's, uh, let's go over a little bit of what they did. We got some pictures and some, uh, some video of those guys working. And uh, this is how it used to be done. They didn't come up with a vinyl wrap and smear it on the side of the car. They sat there and they lettered all this stuff by hand with a brush. Absolutely amazing stuff. Come take a look. <laughs> 